Hi guys, greetings of the day. Myself Vijay Tavadhan and in this video lecture session I am going to show you a solution on projection of plane surfaces. And an example problem is like this. A pentagonal lamina of edges 25 mm is resting on VP with one of its sides such that the surface makes an angle 60 degree with VP. The edge on which it rests is inclined at 45 degree to HP. Draw its projections. Now to solve this problem, one can go to a line command with a thickness of 0.13 and construct an XY line. And after constructing an XY line, name the endpoints of the line as X and Y and represent the first angle projection by marking VP as well as HP above and below the XY line respectively. Then go to applications and in the macros, go to run macro and search for inside polygon which is available in c drive program files solid edge v19 custom inside polygon bin and again inside polygon open and select the flat length whose length is supposed to be set as 25 mm and the number of sides are 5 and then apply a relationship press the left click anywhere on the screen then select the pentagon and the pentagon has to be placed in the VP now because the condition given in VP and then change the thickness of the pentagon to 0.5 millimeter make use of a smart dimensions or distance between command and show that the size of the pentagon is 25 millimeter and to get the top view of a pentagon one has to draw the projectors from the front view till the XY line to get the top view now complete the projectors like this and after drawing the projectors Make use of a line command with a thickness of 0.13. Complete the top view by joining the lines like this as a separate lines to make sure that the projectors will be drawn in the next stage properly. Then make use of a text command and start giving the naming of the corners. So this can be named as A dash. Accordingly, this can be named as B dash. And this is going to be named as C dash. And here it is going to be named as D dash and then this corner can be named as a dash accordingly in the top view this is going to be a inside the brackets t and b inside the bracket d and then finally we are going to get the corner c and after getting these front views and top views now the surface of the lamina makes 60 degree with vp so hence now select the top view completely then go to a move command now move with respect to the corner A and E. A and E is supposed to be on the XY line using a point or element symbol. Then go to a rotate command. Select A E as a fixed point and C is going to be a rotating point and the rotation angle is supposed to be taken as 60 degree and then it should be placed below the XY line. And then make use of the line command with respect to a thickness of 0.13 mm one can complete the required top view by drawing the sorry required front view by drawing the projectors from the top view and c is connected to c and b and d is going to be connected to b and d properly now b is completed and let me draw the projectors for d and then a and e will be drawn to the projectors a and e now after drawing these projectors necessary and after drawing the necessary projectors uh, so sorry and then E is going to be projected to here yes and after which uh, one can go to a text command name the respective corners once again this as A dash and this is going to be B dash and this is going to be C dash and this is going to be D dash and accordingly this is going to be e dash and after drawing these things make use of uh, the line command with a thickness of 0.5 millimeter one can complete the front view that is a dash to b dash b dash to c dash c dash to d dash d dash to e dash and then back to a dash now this completes the required front view and then make use of angle between command and show that the angle between these two lines are supposed to be 60 degree and after which one has to select the front view and this front view has to be rotated at an angle of 45 degree to hp 
now measure the length of AE and measure the length of AE there is no uh, difference in the line and the given angle is called as angle theta sorry angle phi so make use of a line command with respect to zero, uh, thickness of 0 0.13 one can construct an inclined line like this and whose angle is supposed to be set for 45 degree now the line AE is supposed to be drawn on this 45 degree line now 45 degree line has been set select the front view and then go to move command now we know that a and e should be on the line on the 45 degree line now we will locate a on the 45 degree line first then using the rotate command a will be on the 45 degree line and e is going to be on the 45 degree line and after which uh, make use of a line command with a thickness of 0 0.13 complete its top view by drawing the projectors from the right extreme corner now the d dash is going to be connected to d and along with d we have b so let us complete the projectors of b also and then we'll go to the corner c dash and c is going to be projected to c and then uh, a and e will be projected till the x y line and after which uh, make use of the text command and name the respective corners this is going to be named as a and this is going to be named as e and uh, this as uh, d and sorry that is going to be yeah d and this is going to be b and this is going to be c and we have marked a and e wrongly so this is a this is e so we will recorrect it and then uh, make use of the line command with thickness of 0 0.5 millimeter join a, a to b then b to c then c to d d to e then back to a now this completes the problem as per the given conditions and if you are having any sort of doubt feel free to contact me and also please do subscribe to my youtube channel and also share this video to all your first year engineering students which will help me to create more and more videos thank you guys